Okay guys, welcome to the third exercise on arrays. The program must output the largest element in the array and the index at which that element was found. So, we need to remember, remember two things. We need to remember the max element, which I'm going to initialize with minus one, and take care, this only works because we're dealing only with positive integers. If you would deal with negative integers as well, you would have to come up with something different. Uh, but now for the sake of simplicity, let's assume that we only handle uh, positive integers. Um, this is the first thing we need to remember, and the second thing would be max element index. Alright, so now we're going to traverse the array. So, just as we did before, this is already familiar to us, and <coughs> we have to loop through uh, every element of the array, because the max element could be the last one. So there is no shortcut like in the previous exercise. We have to look at every element of the array. So we have to check if the current number if the current number is greater than the maximum element we found so far, all right, then we have just found a new maximum number. So we say max element is our nums of i and we would also need to store the index all right so that's that uh, we now have found the maximum element we found the maximum index and now we have to just write it out so write line um, max element is max element with index max element index. All right. So, let's try this. Max element is 76 with index 0. This is correct. Um, let's make something even greater than that. Max element is 777 with index 8. Always try out your uh, your stuff with different values so you can get a feeling on, on, on how it works. Okay, so that's it for the third exercise. See you in the next video.